Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, coming at you with 2020 Panini Legacy Football. Six box, half case, random team break number 10. There you go. There's all the details there. Some pretty good stuff. Looks like we took some money off of it too. Big thanks to these folks for getting into the action. Really appreciate it. And all 30 teams are in. Remember, this is 2020 edition, so it's the latest draft class. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Four and a three, seven times. Two. And seven, then final time. After seven, we got Zach down to Bradford. Seven times for the teams. And seventh and final time. After seven, we got the Bills. Buffalo! Down to my Raiders. There you go, Las Vegas Raiders. Let's get that there. Let's pop that there. All right, Zach with the Bills, Tim with the Patriots, Jarrell with the Ravens, Justin with the Lions, Joe with the Jags, Peter with the Colts, Cohen with the Vikings, Charles with the Eagles, Cohen with the Saints, Nicholas with the Packers, Jets for Victor, Charles with the Falcons, Justin with the Titans, Rick T with the Bears, Cohen with the 49ers, Brian V with the uh, Cowboys, Barry with the Bucks, Anthony with the Browns, Cohen with the Panthers, Colton with the Seahawks, Matthew with the Bengals, Trevor with the Cardinals, Zach with the Steelers, Fuad with the Rams, Brad with the Chiefs, Natalino with the Texans, Steve with the Giants, Colton with the Broncos, Zach with the Chargers, Brock with the Redskins. It's going to be a new name at some, some point. We're going to have to change that. Cohen with the Dolphins and Bradford with the Las Vegas Raiders. Remember, that name change is not official for the Redskins until we change it on our group break lists here. It's not what not what Dan Snyder and the organization want. It's when when Jaspies changes it on here, that's when you know. It's like, all right, this is this is real now, folks. We're gonna pause the video. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades. I'm gonna go run and grab the box. I'll be right back. All right, welcome back, folks. There were no trades, so that list remains the same on the 14th, Tuesday, 14th. Thanks everyone for getting in. Appreciate it. Break seven nights a week here at jazbeescasebreaks.com. We appreciate you joining us tonight. All right, so it uh, looks like Jason did Legacy 9, maybe Sunday or Monday. So we mark those 10 so we know they're all from the same case. We're looking for that per box on average. We got Favre on the front, Favre on the front. Nick Jaspi says that every time uh, I say Favre, he says like half the time there's always going to be some comment where it's just like, bro, it's Favre. I know it's Favre, ladies and gentlemen. If you're up on your pop culture, you would get the reference. Those people apparently are not. We'll see, Corey. Let's not overhype it too much. Under promise, over deliver. That's the idea. Under promise, over deliver. All right, good luck, everybody. There's Cortland Sutton to 100. So obviously all these rookie cards will ship. It's only here. Do we have some veteran comments here? It's only these comments that won't. I'm pretty sure that's what it says in the description, right? Yeah, no veteran consulship. 
These are inserts, so of course they will ship, like that Legends, and these are obviously rookies. That will ship as well. That makes sense. There's Derek Brown to 50. Oh, and what? I have a checklist here for you. I know there's the hits are still in their college the kids are still in their college gear, so we use that we use that checklist. What's my favorite case to break, Corey? My favorite case to break is 2020 Panini Legacy Football. The break we're doing right now. Available jaspyscasebreaks.com. That's my favorite. I'm glad we're doing it. Thanks for filling it up, ladies and gentlemen. Harrison Bryant, rookie autograph. Not to be confused with Hunter Bryant. Harrison Bryant goes to the Browns. I guess nothing's filled up after this. I could take the time to, if I could find pen, I, I could tag these for the shipping team, make it a little bit easier for them. Anthony with the Browns. All right, we'll sleeve and top load all of those before they go out, of course. Derek Brooks to 199. Lou Keekly to 75. To one to two ninety nine, Jerry Judy. And we've got Brian Edwards from our Raiders. Nice. That goes to Bradford with the Raiders. Nice. Pretty dynamic player here. I think the Raiders are looking forward to seeing him. And the other is in action. All right, nice. Solid first box. This could be the could be the year of the wide receiver. We haven't seen as deep of a wide receiver class like this in a pretty long time. So great start. Can't expect much with Derek Carr's or QB. Well, I think this is definitely a the year Derek Carr has no excuses. That's for sure. I mean, he's had co he now has coaching consistency. He's got a running back. He's got a wide. He's got a lot of pass catchers now. Darren Waller, Tyrell Williams, a lot of young receivers as well. I think next two years will definitely give us the. The, the most true idea of what Derek Carr can accomplish as a quarterback. So, because before, how could you really how could you really evaluate Derek Carr? And coaches are being changed all the time. And there aren't reliable players to on the offense and an effective run to set up the pass, which is something that he needs. You know. Put Mariota in for Carr, the Mariota that got replaced by Ryan Tannehill. Titans lucked out that Tannehill clicked. And Tannehill was not wanted in Miami, was backing up Mariota in Tennessee.
I think Mariota will be used though. I think they'll I think they'll use him in use him more often. In tricky tricky scenarios. They'll they'll write up some plays for him. I don't think he'll just be a true backup. Well, it's not like I'm married to Carr as my QB1, but I'm just saying, you know, I'm just saying that the, that the jury's still out on him for a variety of reasons. I think, uh, nice Chase Young. Great start in this break. Under the lights. Brock with the Washington... Nice, out of 10. Who knows what it could be? But yeah, the jury, the jury's still out on Derek Carr. If he does well, it's kind of a cool, low, cool patch right there. If he does well, great, happy. You know, if he doesn't do well, then team first. The Raiders have to move on. Jared Pinckney to 399. Falcons for him. That'll be for Charles. Corey says, my Patriots got Superman. Don't know how I feel about Newton. I think he needs to be healthy. If he's healthy, you know, and, and maybe as he gets older, transitions a little bit more to being a pocket passer, I think he could be great. But I don't think, I don't think he's the future there. Because I think if Cam Newton does well, guess what? He's signing a big free agent deal with somebody else. And then Jared Sidham, it's great for him. He gets to marinate for another year. Learn the system, you know. Get comfortable with the other young talent on that team. He's under the radar, no pressure. Great for him. Kind of pissed that Brady didn't say with you? Are you really saying that? You kind of turn. Turns out you have to pay. You, you have to pay your star quarterback, star quarterback money. You don't do that, which Belichick has traditionally not not been willing to do. Turns out they want to look for greener pastures, or what they perceive as greener pastures. You should be pissed at your organization. You should be pissed at Belichick. Resman says, let's get that clearly authentic going. Yeah, I'm down. How many spots did you get? I'd like to see another one of those happen tonight. Yeah, ironically, Corey, they'll actually be an hour or so closer to me in Vegas than they would be L.A. to Oakland. So it's pretty much like they're moving out back to L.A. Dolphins, Dan Marino. KJ Hill at a 50. And there's Antonio Gandy Golden. Rookie autograph.
Uh, that will be for the Redskins. Brock Pine with Washington. I haven't learned all of these rookies and where they go just yet. I am not in mid-season form on these players. My all-time favorite Raider? I don't know. I don't really do favorite player type things. I'm more about the name on the front of the jersey. Is Miles Garrett. Hard not to like Bo Jackson, though. Hard not to like Tim Brown. You know, hard not to like Charles Woodson. Out of 150, there's Brandon Ayek. Yeah, it kind of sounds like a coach. It's coach speak. I want winners. I want players that want to win. Two color, dual red, like an autograph, Colin Johnson. Colin Johnson is a Jaguar. Went from a Longhorn to a, to a Jaguar. Joe, with that one. Joe Fagundis to 100. J.K. Dobbins to 50. The minis in their own little pile here. All right, three boxes to go. Everyone see uh, everyone see the new helmets with the Oakley helmet filter. It's pretty interesting. Sure, if all the player do all the players adopt that? You know, helmets are an important thing. It's pretty important. Corey, we have fun in every break. Every break that we do is fun. Always interesting topics to talk about. Always interesting cards that are being pulled. That's what we're all about here. In a nice, chill, low-key environment, what we do. All right, let's see what we got here. Good luck. It's about halfway through this half case break. We'll go through some more orders after this and see what else is sold out, and then we'll get into uh, we'll get into some other breaks. I'm sure we'll probably do. How many? How much time do we have? We have plenty of time. A lot of breaks. So head over to jazbeescasebreaks.com. Let's close out some breaks. Let's make it happen. There's Jared Pinkney. Didn't I just, just had him, didn't I? Where do, you, where, do, where do you go, Jared? Atlanta. So another one for Charles and the Dirty Birds. And there's AJ Bouye to 100. Yeah. To 
299, Travis Kelsey for the Chiefs. Mark Ingram to 199. There's Denzel Mims to 35. That will be for the New York Jets. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo and Last Pod Mojo for Victor. It's uh. First break with us as well. There you have it. Get, get to send you a little something. Can I get a feeling of the whole Jaspi process? All right, two more to go. Next one. Still got two autographs per box on average. We still got potentially four autos to go. These last two boxes. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. We've got a lot of other football in the store. So check it out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We got a, bo a two box break of 2017 Vertex up on the site, boys and girls. And that's a two box number block break. Chance to go Mahomes hunting, if you like. That's been on the site for a minute or two. It might go away if people aren't interested in it. Hi, EA. Yeah, some of those breaks you're going to start to see that checkbox indicating that you've seen uh, that, that, that people have read the item description. You know, as, as, as we grow, as our audience grows, I think we've got to stress the importance of that. There's Yetter Gross Mottos. Are we close on that? That's our third and final box, I believe. Gross Matos is a Panther. Cat Team Mojo for Carolina. Cohen with that one. And we got Jersey and Autograph Isaiah Simmons. Who is Char Charger? Buccaneer? Raider? Oh, Raiders picked up a Cardinal. Man, that was all over the map on that. That will be for Traver. A Traver? Traver? Trevor. I don't know where Traver came from. Trevor with the Arizona Cardinals. I think I almost want. I think I was almost gonna say Travis. Maybe that's what it. There's T Higgins to 199. Out of 25, we've got John Randall, Vikings legend. Or no crust in new 
Chris Carson to 299. We got T.Y. Hilton to 100. little mini guy let's grab grab this Eddie Jackson really quick for the Bears all right last box coming up folks Once again, nothing sold out at the moment, or actually when I started this break, nothing was sold out, but we'll go through some more orders after this final box and after I clean or clear away this break, and then we'll see what direction we're gonna go to on that. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Ooh, nice. That's some nice patch there. Rose Bowl patch right there. Might be some, some sort of sponsor patch right there. Nice. Futures, dual relic, and autograph. Michael Pittman Jr. Went to USC. And Pittman ended up with the Colts. And that's three out of five. Nice low number on that. Who's got the Colts? Peter. There you go. Peter with the Colts, with the blue horseshoes. Three out of five. Out of fives and under. Get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. Nice. What I love about this uh, this legacy, folks. It's a friendly price point and a lot of great patch autos that can pop out of here. It won't short you on surprises. It won't break the wallet either. All right, and we got an out of ten, Jalen Ragor. That, that was that was just enough, Corey. You just relax, enjoy the show. You don't you don't have to backseat drive, backseat drive it. When you start your braking channel, you can do it however you want. Smokey, how what? What what are we, what are we confused about? Chandler Jones, two ninety nine. Not my, uh, not my director, Corey. I already have a boss here, the boss man. It's Kobe Brissett. All right, Dalvin Cook, thirty five. And last one is C. J. Henderson from Florida.
Jaguar, how would you buy a car that somebody else pulled? Well, pretty easily. No, I won't facilitate that. But they would just make a deal. They, he just just want dibs. No, we don't. We don't. We've got too much on our plate to be a middleman for people's sales. That'd be a nightmare. We're not at that level yet. There's Joe Fagundis right there. And there you go, folks. That's it. Um, random team 10 in the books. 2020 Panini Legacy Football. That's the second half of the case. Looks like the first half had a rip card. Ooh, the Prescott rip card. Are you gonna are you gonna rip it? Dan's got it. All right. Well, there you go, folks. Um, I, I don't know if we have any more legacy, but let's keep keep an eye on more for Jazby's from on Jazby's Case I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye bye.